Anas Benis, Claudio Castagneta, Ben Matson, Quilem Registre, Gladys Tully, Freddy Villanueva. Those are but a few of the names of people killed by police in Canada. In Montreal alone, 60 people have died in police-related incidents since 1987. The Justice for Victims of Police Killings Coalition held its third annual commemorative vigil in front of the Montreal Police Brotherhood building. We're here today for justice, to demand justice. We need justice. Our families have been killed by the police. There's no procedures, no nothing. Julie Matson is one of several family members and relatives of victims who joined the coalition. Her father was beaten to death by Vancouver police in 2002. For Matson, the vigil is a way to share the story of her loss and raise awareness on the issue of police brutality. This kind of stuff happens to regular people and they can die as a result of it. My mother was struck and killed by the Quebec police in 2001 on the Kitagon CB Reserve in Maniwaki. The brother of the cop that killed my mother is in charge of the investigation. And there we have the vicious circle, police investigating on the police, and of course, police refusing to uh, blame, accuse uh, one of their own. Last year, former Minister of Public Safety Robert Dutille proposed a procedure for civilian overlook of police-run inquiries. The Rights and Liberties League is asking for a more impartial, independent and transparent investigation process when civilians are wounded or killed by police officers. We think that the process should be under the Ministry of Justice, which is a question of justice, and not under the Public Safety Minister, because the Public Safety Minister is the ministry responsible for the police. The After years of procedures, many families are still being denied information about how and why their relatives died. They demand that authorities put in place mechanisms to prevent it from happening to other people. This month would have been um, my dad's 60th birthday. And instead of celebrating with him, I'm here with all of you. And I'm remembering his life and his unnecessary death. The coalition asks for the end of police violence and impunity and for independent inquiries into police-related deaths. The police service and the Police Brotherhood of Montreal declined our request for comments or interviews.